place. Hi. I thought we were meeting at uh, two o'clock. That time didn't work for me anymore. Oh, okay. Um, have a seat. Uh, I would have prepared better if I knew you were coming early. Are you hungry? What did you want to see me about? Look, I got something for you. What's that? Something little. Please open it. I thought you pawned all of Mom's jewelry. Yes, I bought it back from the store I sold it. Five years in the pawn shop and no one wanted it. I guess it must have been fate. I'm very happy to give it to you. You think I need this now? Gracie. No, shut up, Howard. Five years ago, I needed a father's guidance. I lost the only woman I have ever been with. I lost her, too. I didn't know what to do. I'll tell you what you did. You left a little girl there to be stranded with that female waste. She helped me through impossible times. What, by introducing you to drugs and leeching off of your life savings? I know. Okay, and where is she now, now that you're a felon living in a halfway house? Look. Oh no, I'll tell you where she is. She's out there leeching off of the next guy that will have her. But please, give your father the smallest friction of chance to, uh, to... No, 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 you know what, you're right. There are no words. My father died five years ago and you're just some used up resemblance to someone that I used to care about. What about the words on your mother's bracelet? You keep the bracelet. Maybe the words will remind you of the three things that you stole from me. 